Okay, hey guys, GRMT here, doing a, uh, Gecko, Leopard Gecko Beta Dragon update, and this is my Leopard Gecko Enigma, Raptor, she's a Raptor, I just named her Enigma because, I don't know, it just seemed like a cool name, and if you watch my recent videos, you guys know that she lost part of her tail because of shedding. I uh, guess she didn't get it off all the way, and I wasn't here at the time. I was at my dad's house. So, yeah. And she's closing her eyes. She's, for some reason, I have no idea why. She, she is awake. I don't know why she's closing her eyes. Like, she just closed them. Okay, yeah, that's her. And she has, like, that bright orange spot right there. Right there on her back so yeah she's pretty cool and I'm gonna go put her back in her cage this is their cage I oh sorry and I changed their cage a lot so here is their cage uh that's like uh terrarium moss Moss, and then they have a rock right there, a long rock right there, and then a rock right there. And then I put this long rock on top of both so it can make a hide under there. And it can make like this moist spot they could hide on. There's a coconut, uh, and there's a rock right there, and leaves, and um, just like a hide. Waterable. So let's get our next leopard gecko. And here is my first leopard gecko. Uh, lavender. Nothing's changed with her. She's just in shed right now. So yeah, that's her. She's really dark right now. She is a tangerine designer. Um, she's a tangerine designer giant. And yeah, with lavender in like around, like she has lavender spots. So let's get her next gecko. Okay, here's my second leopard gecko I ever got. Um, her name is Breezy. She is a bell albino. I think that's what she is. Um. That I finally figured it out, so I think she's a bell. She has like, I don't know if this is enough to be a carrot tail. Sorry, guys. Right there. I don't know if that's enough to be a carrot tail. Like, she has like a lot of orange. Like, looking down her tail, brown and white. And she has really cool eyes. But she does not have red eyes. She just has like, silvery eyes, kind of. Sorry, trying to focus it. My camera's not focusing. Let me put it down first. There you are. Right there. Pretty cool. Nothing changed with her. Let's get the next leopard gecko. Okay. So now we have Sunny, my third leopard gecko I got. And she's regenerated tail before I got her. She was just a little baby. She has like three lavender spots on her. And I think she's like a jungle tangerine. I have no idea. And she's like lavender on her head. She has really like bold spots. Like the really dark, bold spots, like right there, that's one of them. And she has a really bright carrot tail, bright yellow, like right there. So she has. Hold on, guys, let me turn on my light. Helps a little bit. She's running away from me. 
Okay, so here she is. She's going crazy. Okay. They all ate already, so. She has, like, same eyes as everybody else. Okay, so. Let's put her back. And let's get her last gecko. She's in deep shed right now. Like, she looks like a Lewis... Lewis Cedic, or I think that's how you say it, Gecko. Um, she's, but she's a super hypotangerine, uh, super hypotangerine, Caratel, Baldy. She has like, yeah, she's just a Baldy. She's my biggest one. And she, uh, she's just a super hypo, Caratel, Baldy. She's almost 10 inches, she's 9 right now so yeah she's pretty cool but she's in deep shed I just gave her a bath and yeah that's her the flash isn't working that's her and now on to my male leopard geckos uh, Okay, now here's my biggest leopard gecko, his name is Swiss, okay his name is Swiss, he has these awesome, uh, he has these awesome like white dots, he has this awesome pattern on his head, he is a tangerine jungle albino. And he has a really cool carrot tail. It looks like he has like a raptor tail. If you guys know what I'm talking about. And yeah. And he has awesome eyes. I'm trying to get it on camera. This is just an update on him. I had an unboxing video of him. Most of you guys probably saw it. I don't know. And if he could stop moving, I could get a shot of him. Well, yeah. He has, like, these red, like, lines throughout his eyes. A guy from Garrick the Meyer. Thank you a lot for Garrick. Thank you a lot, Garrick, for uh, giving me, sending me this gecko. Make sure you go check out his... Website, crestedgecko.com. He's really good. He has great geckos and a wide selection. And that's just my, uh, that's just my, like, worm. This is where all the worms are. There's lettuce in there. And over here, here's just supplies and stuff water, sanitizer, spray bottle, gallon water. And in here, there are my baby worms. Here's in there. I just like separate the baby worms from the big worms. Sorry. And in here, I have like larvae. And for, uh, I thought larvae at first, I thought they don't move. But when I touch like the bottom half of their body, they start to move. I'm going to turn the flash on. So you could see him better. Oh, that's my larvae. It's not focusing. But if I touch like the bottom half of his body, it will start to move. If I could pick it up, it moves. So I didn't really know what that was. And I just have lettuce in there, so when they turn into beetles. Just get the lettuce, and I have lettuce in the baby worms, and that's my adult worms in there. I just I lost my ten gallon like well my ten gallon thing broke, 
So I used a five gallon cover and put it across like that and put this light fixture on it. It said purple. It looks blue on the camera, but it's purple. Uh, it's a purple light. It looks blue, but it's purple. It goes up to like 85 degrees. And here is my other male. I might name him Cinnamon. I don't know. But here's his enclosure. He has like a hide right there. And he has like moss on he has moss on top of the newspaper. And he is right here on his cool side. Sorry guys. He is a bell albino. I don't know what I should name him. I'm thinking of cin cinnamon. Yeah! And I'm naming him cinnamon. I might. And he has cool eyes too. He's a bell. He's yellow. He really likes his enclosure. There's calcium dish. Whoop. Calcium dish right there. Uh, water dish right there. I have to take out that. I have to clean out his water dish. There's some moss inside his water dish. And a bigger hive with a little bit. Oh, sorry. A bigger hive with a little bit more moss in there. Okay. And that's my that's all my leopard geckos. That's seven. And I'm getting a crested gecko like the next two months or something because I'm gonna be breeding. My leopard geckos is gonna sell some of the babies. I didn't get a crested gecko. So this might be Yes. I don't know. Hold on. And there is my bit of dragon cage. All set up. My grandmother put a bowl inside there. I don't know why. I have to take that out, but I just put lettuce on it. And calcium in the back. And then that's him. He's been sitting here that for a long time. He was just trying to get some lettuce. So that's him running away. I got him for Christmas in December. This year, and that's him. And I don't know what kind of morph he is. I don't like. He's trying to get inside his cage. I don't like focus. Well, I try to like do what kind of morphs of Bitter Dragon, but it's hard for me because I didn't start out doing it. But with the Warbird Geckos, I had like did all the morphs already. So I don't know. But if you guys know what kind of morph he is, could you please help me out with that? He might just be like a normal. I have no idea what he is, what kind he is. And thank you. And this is my Red Dragon update and Leopard Gecko. And most of you guys might be thinking like this doesn't keep in the heat really good, but it goes up to like 105, which is pretty good. And yeah. I have a night light right there. It looks orange, but it's red. I have a heat bulb right there. Uh, it looks awkward right now. Right there. And then fluorescent. Um, and comment below and t and could you guys tell me if I should keep the fluorescent bulb on this side where he uh just to put some light on that side, or should I keep it on this side where he's always at? Because he sleeps on this side, but he basks on this side, and sometimes he goes on that side, but not a lot. So, if you guys could help me out with that, that would be great. And thank you for watching this video. Comment, rate, subscribe. Bye.